Alpha Logistics have a huge experience of operating in East Africa. They support the whole marine environment and the energy, oil and gas industries. Our fleet of tugs, barges and supply ships are suitably geared to carry out offshore support and supply operations based out of Mombasa, Dar es Salaam, Pemba and Matwara ports. Some 200 kilometers southwest from Dar is the Songo Songo gas field. Alpha Logistics are supplying Pan-African energy with total support for the critical work that the Paragon rig is undertaking with working over the existing wellheads and drilling new wells. My name is David Oko. I am the Marine Superintendent for Alpha Logistics. My tasks in uh, this project is I'm in charge of all the Alpha vessels and to make sure that the operation goes on with, without any incident or any problem. The barges are quite important because in, like in this position that we were doing where the rig is, it is shallow. Therefore, deep sea vessels with a bigger draft cannot come alongside. So the barges are quite ideal. And also, the barges have a big space with a crane on it. It makes it easier to take cargo from any vessel that will be coming alongside, put on the bigger barge, and then the rig can take straight from the barge. Also, we had the barges on portage starboard with gangways connected from the rig to the barges. And we have a gangway from the barges going down that a small boat can access easily. This was uh, very good for uh, change of crew and in case of any emergency as an escape route. We were involved in rigging down the rig so that the rig could be ready to be moved from the current position into the next drilling position. So we, these barges were uh, in position by anchors. We had to take out all the anchors before we could move the barges out and clear the rig to give it a, a be ready for the rig move the next day. My name is Armando Marcelino Rodriguez. I am presently the captain of Alpha Kirawira this ship. Alpha Kirawira belongs to Alpha Logistics and she is now engaged on a project, a really crucial project, which brings the drilling equipment for the extraction of the gas here in Songo Songo. It's really a, a very important project and uh, crucial because all the items which you carry is supposed to be really arrive safely and in time. Six, nine meter long and it's uh, 15 meter wide. She can uh, carry up to 1,200 tons of uh, liquid, gas oil, whatever. She can carry also a container on, on deck. It's a nice ship and more nice because she can even go to the shallow waters. She she's multi-purpose. She can go to the beach, she can say that she's a landing craft, she can land, can discharge, on off, offload and unload, roll on, roll off. She's just fantastic vessel. Alpha Logistics proudly use 90% of local crew in all their major areas of operations. Kirawira was even built in Seco's shipyard in Mombasa Harbour. We are now in our head office in Mombasa, where we are managing our fleet of vessels, where we have our export processing zone and our machine shops. My name is Abdallah Afman. So in the EPZ facility, these equipments were supplied and um, they were enjoying the tax benefit, not paying duties and VAT. Our Mombasa base has been the key point of the success with Songo Songo project. Today we are loading a new shipment of casings 
which has to be delivered to Pan African in Songo Songo Island. Within two days from the departure of the vessel, the shipment will be delivered in Songo Songo. From here, we are serving the entire East African coast with the support of the other companies of Alpha Group, Southern Engineering and Southern Shipping. My name is Cyrus Gashagwa. I'm the shipping manager at Alpha Logistics. As market leaders in this niche market, we have been able to serve our customers with lots of dedication, keeping to our schedules, and accepting cargo even under very uh, difficult situations. Aside from our marine logistic activities, we also provide engineering, offshore and onshore support to our clients. We demonstrate that as a group of companies, we can offer 10 solutions solution to our clients, not only for oil and gas, but also for all the infrastructure projects in East Africa. At Alpha Logistics, we don't stop at logistics, we go beyond. I'm um, Captain Malcolm Shakespeare, uh, employed by Pan African Energy as their marine superintendent to look after the assets of the Songa Songa gas field, that's the platforms and the pipelines, because as you can see, we've got a lot of boats operating here and it's important that there's no accidents and that nobody drops an anchor on the pipes or hits the platforms. So to date, touch wood, we've been okay, we haven't had uh, any incidents. This operation started three months ago. Uh, the rig has been involved in cleaning the wellheads of all the gas in Songo Songo Island. As you can see over to the south there, we've got the 826 on the um, SS7. She's finished drilling now, or doing the work over, and we're now going to move to this site, SS12, which is just slightly to the north and east of where she is at the moment, towards the island. I'll be going on board one of the vessels with the three captains and the rig mover to discuss what we're going to do. The general idea is that we're going to come off, the, the, the 826 will jack down and come afloat. She draws about 10 feet of water and we'll be towing her out to the west into the deep water and then turning the 826 and towing back through the narrow channel out towards where the red boy is over towards the island there which marks the SS12 position. Our Songo Songo project is the successful result of the turnkey service we can offer a client. The joint forces of Southern Engineering who modify the barges and cranes, Hunting Alpha with the transiting of new casings and, of course, Alpha Logistics, who all come together under the Alpha Group to offer services beyond logistics. Such operation involves quite a lot. It's a very risky operation. Therefore, it needs quite a lot of focus and dedication. Now, with the excess weight offloaded and the rig floating, Alpha's trained captains are going to move the rig to its new drilling position. The project involving Alpha Logistics and the, the boats and the barges and the, the crews has been quite exceptional. I mean, obviously, you can imagine that when we're running a big project like this, there's going to be hiccups and there's going to be problems, etc., etc. But in real terms, we haven't had that many problems. I'm proud of working with the company Alpha Group that is going places and going more up and up. And I'm very happy because I'm part of the team that is making that happen. That's good. A very good uh, ops manager in David Oku. I've worked, worked with him all the time and we get on really well together. The captains of the small boats and the big boats, every time we want them to do anything, they're always there to help, so they've been really good. Alpha Logistics.